I believe in continuous testing and iteration. You know, we absolutely achieved the, the initial goals for the test were to understand the performance of the pump, be able to put that into a simulation system. We're going to continue to use that to develop these different failure scenario models, but only through iteration do we really perfect uh, products and make it highly reliable. Picking a cooling fluid that has intrinsic safety properties pushes us towards a architecture of a reactor called a high temperature gas reactor. And so you need to flow that gas through the nuclear reactor to keep it cool and extract power from it. We need something that pushes that helium continuously through, and that is a motor. So our helium circulator is a purpose-built motor that's meant to operate at the temperatures that the nuclear reactor runs at and the pressure that the nuclear reactor runs at. So we've been working on the helium loop test and the helium circulator for a really long time, actually. The helium circulator was the first thing that we really had to nail down at Radiant. The reason for that is that the reactor is effectively solid state. There are very few moving parts intentionally so that the reactor can operate for years without maintenance. And the one exception to that is the helium circulator. So it's intentionally the most complex piece of machinery in the primary loop. The main objective for the helium loop test was to test the performance of a circulator in the conditions that it would see in Kaleidos, so high temperature and high pressure. We wanted to make sure that the performance of the circulator matched what was predicted by CFD, and so we did that by testing it in real-world conditions. Accomplishing this test was great not just for actually performing a check on the hardware specifically, but also building up the infrastructure for the team and being able to perform this kind of testing. We had to go through hardware builds, software implementation. It was a way to be able to build and establish the infrastructure and the processes for the entire team to be able to perform tests like this and continue building upon tests in the future and be able to execute even faster as a company. I love this engineering team. We've got a lot of really, really sharp people and a lot of really open-minded people. Our crown jewel piece of hardware, the circulator, is operating awesomely. I'm really confident in our, our methodology for bringing this loop up to speed, that we built something that's like truly safe. Getting our bearings on how to design a high pressure, high temperature system. Kind of the main design goal of every system that we put into the reactor is safety above everything else. So it must be fundamentally intrinsically safe if it's going to be a part of the design. 